Right guys, um, a little bit of a different video around a couple of conversations about I want to be rich. Um, I've been what about four people in the last week or so that's on this trail. I want to be rich. I want to be this. I want to be that. The concept of wealth is not monetary. The concept of wealth is about time. The concept of wealth is about having the time to do what you want to do or would like to do or aspire to do. That's more relevant than cash because you can be busy doing stuff you don't want to do and have as much money as you like, but you never get to spend it, use it, um, which sort of defeats the object. So what I can say is it's about setting goals on where you want to be, what you want to achieve, um, and having an output. Um, it's a bit like when somebody, you know, they try to get a comparison on wealth, you know, they go, oh, well, I've got, I don't need to know um, how much money somebody's got or whatever, because I don't care. In the same way, I'm not getting into a contest on, go, I've got this, I've got that. That stuff detests me, big style, because if you're not happy where you are, then you need to adjust your context. You need to have a look at why aren't you happy there? Why do you need my reassurance you're doing well? Um, because in life, you should be enjoying it as much as you can. You should be trying to experience it as much as you can. And... Uh, Although money is important, it shouldn't be the ultimate goal. Getting as much out of life as possible is the ultimate goal. So for me, when people are actually asking me about wealth and about my personal stuff, none of your business. <laughs> as simple as that. Um, I am doing better than most, but I don't need to advertise the fact. Um, I mean, we've got a few things on the on the go at the moment. Obviously, the Spanish side, the house, we just bought the house. We've got about 40,000 euros worth of renovations going on. Um, but after that sorted, we'll be getting a boat um, and aiming to have five properties in the same town. At the same time, it's not me going, look what I've got or what I'm doing. That is my goals. That's my, not retirement project, but it's more... Uh, setting in stone a long term future and don't get me wrong I know people are going to go the end of the world is nigh with old posters up um, whatever happens with the globalisation changes I think the concept of being able to work from anywhere is going to increase so having a location that is next to beaches airports all that sort of stuff um, is a long term place um, the other side of that being is that the area seems to be slowly um, transforming. A lot of the buildings were probably 1978 onwards, so there's a lot of old stock there. But what you're finding um, near where we are on the same row, in front, etc., a lot of the older places have been knocked down, um, and some of them are selling near a million euros apiece. So, from an investment point of view, I think that land's going to go up anyway. But that's not that's not the end game for me because the end game is steady cash flow, rent out holiday rentals, live by the beach, office overlooking the sea, and just plodding along and enjoying life, uh, spending more time with the kids, all that sort of stuff. That's that's what's important. Now, don't get me wrong, I work hard to get to that goal, but the ultimate goal is not the money. The ultimate goal is to get to a point um, where I can do everything I want for the long term, set the kids up for a future, all that sort of stuff. And I know some of you guys aren't into that, but to be fair, me, your view of life is yours, mine is to leave a future for the, the, um, the kids. So that's what I'm working on. Um, but at the same time, it also means once this is all up, set up, running, I can be more mobile as well and start stepping away from work. But even now, 
because um, the work I've been in has been very intense um, due to um, when I arrived it wasn't a good place and it took a lot of time to get the wheels turning but this is getting to the point where the wheels are actually doing this instead of not going anywhere and in some cases going backwards it's it's taken a lot of effort and work to the point where I can start going okay it's now ticking over start slowing it down a bit um, and the difference is it's going to become more of a lifestyle change you know in the sense of house is bought it's renovated move on to the next project and start not winding down but having more time for the family having more time for the kids having more time uh, with April spending uh, more time on my hobbies my interest um, that's that's what's important that's what the true value is not whether you're driving a Ferrari or driving a Lamborghini or the amount of money you got in the bank because if you're not using it, spending it, enjoying it it's a waste of time um, no, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying spend all of it I'm just saying you've got to get to the position where you're enjoying life off it that's the important bit not the money is the main objective life is the main objective that's that's your one and only goal that should be the pinnacle that you had a life not a case of you just existed um, so yeah that's my key bit of info on that one today thanks for watching